states have been added to the state of emergency in Georgia, bringing the total number of counties under a state of emergency now to 16. The National Weather Service says the Albany tornado is at least an EF2 tornado. This could be upgraded. A storm tracer shot this video on the southeast side of Albany. Now, this is one of the first tornadoes we've ever seen captured on video in this area. And within the last hour, we've learned the names of two people who died at a mobile home park off of Holly Drive. The coroner says 82-year-old Paul Freeman and 39-year-old Oscar Rania died. The coroner spoke with us about the rumored number of people who died in the storms. We have heard all kinds of rumors, uh, uh, 60, 70 people to, uh, deceased, but that is not true. The only thing we have is four deceased person at this time. As of now, there is no official cause of death for those two men, but we are going to give you the latest on WALB.com. Right now, the search for a missing two-year-old is coming to an end for the night. Doherty County Police Captain Thomas Jackson told me that officers were told by parents about 930 last night their two-year-old son was missing. Now, the boy has not been seen since that storm hit their home, according to the parents. Their home is in the Piney Woods Mobile Home Park. It's in about the 4,000 block of Sylvester Road. Still no sign of the child. Officials will continue to treat this case as a missing person.